Hello everyone, how are ya? Shadeen here. I've been MIA for a couple of days. So my mom has been here and I've really just been enjoying having her here and especially enjoying the help with Mia because um, the last two days I've come home and since I came home, um, you know, just spent a little bit of time with the baby and then I was able to sleep also. She cooks, you know, I could come home and have something to eat for breakfast and, you know, typically um, before I'd come home and I'd cook and stuff, but you know, she's here and she cooks and just the nostalgia in enjoying breakfast from my mom like when I was a kid is something special you know so I've been able to do that like this morning we came home I spent some time with Mia and then um, we slept together for a little bit and then my mom came in with some breakfast and then she took her from me and that was absolutely great like I'm so grateful for her and for her help even though she's here for a very very short while so that is great I have to go on the road today and one of my friends is coming to pick me up. I'm going to go get her a SIM card and we're going to hang out for a little bit and maybe have some coffee because typically when we do hang out, that is one of the things that we do. We get some coffee and we chat and it's all good times. So that, I think that is going to be the plan. So I'm going to get ready right now because my friend just asked me what my address is and I did send it over. Mm, I've sent my address to my friend so many times, it's ridiculous at this point. But um, I sent it over. I'm gonna go in the bathroom and brush my teeth because I had fish for breakfast. I had sardines um, and some fried dumplings. Oh my god, the fried dumplings felt like home. God. Anyways, I'm gonna go brush my teeth, do some mouth care, find something that I need to wear. It is cold outside. And then, um, yeah, I'm gonna just make sure that I am ready for when a um, friend gets here. Um, I don't have to be running around getting ready and stuff like that. And I do need to collect the money for the SIM card from my mom. So, um, yeah, that is what I've been up to the last couple of days and what I have planned for today. Mia is currently out in the living room just enjoying her grandmother and uh, talking. And she's been eating so much more since she's been here in terms of like my mom is just giving her new stuff while I'm here scared shitless to give her anything. So that's also amazing. Um, so yeah, I do um, enjoy having her hair um, right now. So yeah, there's that. But she also brought me this outfit. Oh wait, but... Mm. Ignore the spit up. And you know, we have a little mom body going on here. But one thing she's going to do is bring me a darn outfit. The package is out for delivery, but also another package should also be out for delivery, but also I have to get my stuff together and make sure I'm ready to go. I also think that yellow is my color, but I'm currently in a space where I do not enjoy bright colors, especially wearing bright colors out. But honestly, I really think I don't enjoy bright colors in general. I like neutrals and very muted tones, and if I'm going to do colors like pink hair, I'm gonna do something that is like the pastels that are more soft and warm and not too much. Not screaming out on the wall like this yellow that I am wearing, but I don't mind doing pops of color. I'm struggling to find uh, wall decor for the living room mainly because I don't, I feel like it needs a pop of color in there, especially when I put Mia's little play mat down but also I do not want to get something that's so very bright and odious and then I don't enjoy it anymore. So I'm really struggling with that. I should have a mirror delivered in the next couple of days for the entryway. I think I told you guys about that before. And then I'm going to move that mirror from the entryway over the nightstand. I'm very excited about that. I don't know what that's going to look like, but I am very excited about that. It's going to be behind everything on the nightstand. So I'm going to take you guys along that process whenever I do get it. But for right now, I need to get my stuff together and get ready and see where the day takes us. So see you guys later or so. Hello, you guys. I'm now realizing that my battery needs to be charged. But I just spent the last maybe 30 to 45 minutes out the block at the store getting a phone for my mom so she can have something to use while she's here. Also, mommy, the passing the process was very quick. Because typically when you open them stores, I think the last time we went and we did it on Jamaica Avenue, it takes so long. Mm -hmm. 
we were sitting in there for a while. But I think because we bought the phone and everything same time as well, it was so quick. Because he all he had to do was take a new SIM card, pop it in the phone, and activate it. You know what I mean? As opposed to doing all of that stuff. You guys, it came on because I got a deliver. I got this heatless curler for my hair because I'm wearing the extensions and stuff. I'm pretty sure everybody has seen this going around on social media. Pop it in, wrap the hair around it, then put the scrunchies on the end, and it comes with a little grab clip. So cute. So at night, I'm going to wrap the hair around it, so in the mornings when I wake up, it's going to have the curls. Damn, this can't even open. I bought this for the bathroom. It's supposed to scrub the walls. We'll have to see. My birthday is coming up, and I'm trying to get me something to wear for my birthday, so I bought this pair of shoes. And I bought it in a size nine and let's let's be freaking for real if we're not gonna be anything else. This is Shein. Okay, so far the quality is pretty good. It looks nice. Looks like it's built well and you can wear it a couple of times. But what I loved about it most importantly is the heel because as you guys know, them skinny heels, real hard to walk in, girl. I'm gonna try it on and see. I'm wearing socks right now, so that's not a good judge. But also if it fits with the socks, it's good. Yeah. Oh, it fits nicely and I bought it in gold because while I have black shoes and I have nude and everything I don't have a gold and I've been going out before and my sister is like yeah you definitely need a gold shoes and a gold bag to go with that outfit and I just don't have it so I said now is a good time to buy something gold so we have that yeah I bought a gold bag as well my mom's asking if I bought a gold bag to go with the gold shoe and I did because I didn't have a gold purse prior to this this battery is done like a dog. Eh? Where are worried about going exactly? That church. I bought. Okay, hold on. I bought some little earrings because when I'm going out too, I typically default to wearing my little knobs and my sister literally hates them. She said sometimes you gotta change the earring to kind of spruce up the outfit a little bit. I'm a boring basic girl. Okay, so I bought some. The earrings are so cute. They're um, like small, long drops, but they're like very pretty. Uh, oh, I bought something for Mia. I think when you have kids, it's almost impossible to buy something for yourself and not buy something for them. So I bought a, a, a little outfit for myself, and then I saw this little black dress for her, and I'm like, oh, we can take pictures together in the matching little dress. I love that. For when I wash it, I just wrap this up around it and allow it to dry. Oh, baby, I had two. I had two blue ones that were in deplorable conditions. They were going through it. They looked so bad. I literally had to throw them out and buy one. And I should have bought two because it was like a dollar for one. I really should have bought two. Also, I could just go to Dollar Tree and buy one more. But I'm not going to lie. This quality feels better than the one I bought at the Dollar Tree before. Valentine's Day is coming up, even though when you guys see this video, it might already be after Valentine's Day. And it's one thing about me, I'm going to dress Mia up and I'm going to take a picture of her for everything. This little balloon says love and I bought matching Valentine's Day outfits for her and I. I bought these um, everyday lightly lined t-shirt bras on Shein because I feel like all of my bras are push up and I want something that's not push up, just, you know, really light, not too much padding, whatever, for when I'm going to work. It does have the underwire, so this pack came with nude and black i'm not expecting them to last me for the rest of my life because let's face it i bought it on shein for nickels and dimes so i'm not expecting it to last forever basically i have i bought three birthday dresses because it's one thing about me i don't like having just one option just in case when i put it on i don't like how it looks on my body Especially right now with my post baby body, you know, everything is not going to fit me how it used to and how I like it to. And so I have to make sure that I have options in the event that I don't like how something fits me or looks on me. I bought this phone case. And I'm almost sure there's supposed to be a, another part to it. That probably just fell. Actually, the one little thing that I was seeing on the floor is it. So it's that, and you put this into here, and that's how that works. So very cute. And I have this one as well with a heart on there because I work on a, basically like a cardiac floor at work, telemetry, heart monitors and all. So I thought that that was very fitting. I bought this little um, pajama set for myself for Valentine's Day. It's white with red hearts. 
here's the kicker. Forget about me, it's long pants and it's long sleeve. I got something similar for Mia. Red or white. It's a little pant. With a long sleeve. Is that not so stunning? Are you kidding me? That's so cute, right? So, we're gonna be matching on Valentine's Day and take pictures. Oh. I think this is another one of the birthday dresses. And let me tell you something. When I try those on, they better fit. Or I'm going to be in here sewing some shit up myself. Oh, I bought some black tiny scrunchies for her hair. Because her I think this pack came with 100. Because her little hair can't hold in a, in a big in a big scrunchies. She also needs some teeny weeny baby scrunchies. But also, these teeny weeny baby scrunchies, they stretch a little bit where even I could like put one on my... On my little ponytail you know so i'd love those i bought some for her before in color so i said you know what i'm gonna get her some black ones see on my little ponytail and she's cute i bought these little hair i'm gonna have a it girl moment okay whether it be on my birthday on valentine's day mia and i we're gonna put these in her hair and it's gonna be cute you're supposed to do like a little half up put the thing in it like that and then the little half down imagine me pinning this giving me a one little pigtail Pinning this on her pigtail and her non-existent hair back is just out. Stunning. She's going to be sick of me. I'm telling you all right now. And this one, they had two phone cases together for like two or three dollars. And me, it's one thing about she and they're going to sell me some cute phone cases for a dollar. It was two dollars for the two. This one says you got you got this babe and I love that and this one just has some hearts on there. Y'all know I'm a girly girl by nature and I'm gonna have some cute pink shit. My favorite color is pink. Today I was saying that this yellow thing that my mom bought me looks so cute on me and it's yellow and typically I don't really go for bright colors. Oh baby, I plan on having a moment for my birthday. Okay, I was saying all of this and none of this might manifest. Okay, a bottle of stocking with one line up on the leg, back and front, because I bought a um, a blazer dress. So I'm supposed to wear the blazer dress with the black stocking with pumps. So cute. If you get the vision, you get it. If not, baby, catch up. This is a, oh, I think I bought four birthday options then. Well, I'm gonna have me some options. Oh. I bought this for me as an iPad because you know what? She has an old iPad that I've had for years that one of my one of my best friends gave me. So I saw this little dangly thing and I bought it for her iPad because guess what? The lady is gonna get to a stage where she wants to watch what she wants to watch, and you basically how you work this? Oh, you gotta open it like so. Do you? Oh. And you put it onto a surface and then you just tighten it back. Right. And then now this piece, you put it on here. But um, she's going to get to a point where I'm having her watch like a little programs and stuff like that. Right now I'm trying to do not too much TV. Not too much TV and stuff like that. You know, because I want her little brain to develop without all the colors from TV. You know, you know so much extra stimulation and stuff like that. But eventually she's going to get to the point where she's going to be she's gonna have her ipad and watch what she wants to watch because you know she's a baby and that's just how babies are i bought this other pair of earrings and all the outfits that i have in mind this will look so cute with and i'm look at these earrings mommy so cute right so stunning so you know i'm i'm a simple girl and it would not be true to my character to get something that still isn't simple but you know a little dressy but still a little simple so i bought these ones and these go with all the outfit options that i did buy so i love these as well so you see the gold shoes the gold i mean i have a red dress in there the red dress is kind of out there i'm not gonna lie oh that's so cute very cute so that goes with the gold shoe but i just lost the little rubber back that goes with it but i bought this one too Let's show y'all. So very pretty. So I bought some dainty, pretty earrings that I could, you know, use this one. The back of it is bent and shit. Oh. Um, but yeah, that's all I bought. The